fishing. Hopefully shoot a couple hogfish and groupers and then do a little catch pen cook. That's about it. We're gonna hop in. I'm gonna throw him. Throw him. <laughs> He's a little NASA. But he spooked. He's That thing made you work for him. <laughs> Hold him up. Hold him up for the camera. There you go, Christian. You see it? You just see that one? This one likes lettuce. Hey, yeah. It's like that pig. 
God, they got chompers. You want a little bit of lettuce and corn? Hey, baby. I'm feeding. All right, it's the next day after diving. I'm here with Stormy and the Captain Lily, and she's doing a little hogfish painting. What's it called exactly? Yeah, taco. It's the traditional name. I don't know how to say that, but she's done a couple of rough drafts. They look really good. That definitely looks fake right now. More affordable than a fish mount. Mm -hmm. Won't tell the anglers that I said that. Looks pretty cool to me. I don't know. That hogfish looked like he was like three pounds when Christian pointed out to me. And you guys sadly did not even get to see the shot because I looked at the clip and my GoPro angle was wrong <laughs> on my head, but that's how it goes sometimes. But Stormy's gonna come outside and film me clean the fish. Is that okay? Yeah. We're doing it, we're doing it. And then we're gonna leave Lily to it in here, but we'll show you some final, some final results at the end. beautiful Nassau grouper. He is not too big at all, but my hand's in his gill plate. But um, he's going to be really clean. And Lily and Storm said they both wanted grouper sandwiches, so that's what we're going to do. I'm playing my six inch Dexter blade today. You can use code ADAM20 to save 20% off. I'll have a link down below. You can use you can use that code to save anything off their website. Doesn't matter what it is, you know, you know, make it work. You guys have seen me play a million times, just outlining the fish. That's all I'm doing. Super simple. I know there's still some people out there in the world who can't fly that fish, and the only way to do it is, yeah, you can watch all the YouTube videos and want, but you gotta get out there and do it yourself. Practice on little fish, you know? Even if you're not eating it, you can use the, those fish as bait, or chum, or whatever it is. Practice on trash fish, bonitas, it doesn't matter, but you're only gonna get better if you keep trying. All right, Stormy? Right. Stormy's actually gotten really good at playing the last couple days here. Fine. Yeah, this grouper is so slimy. And fun fact for you guys, there's actually one day where me and Stormy went out in that dinghy right there and shot a pretty nice Kubera on pole spear right outside of her house. And she was like, Adam, bring the GoPro. I'm like, oh, I'm not gonna need it. You didn't get to see that because I didn't bring the GoPro. <laughs> Sorry about it. But I can't put it there. That's our first grouper flay. And sometimes they have worms like this. Look at this. You just cut them out. They are harmless anyways. You can eat them. Look at this, Stormy. See the worm in his meat? You want to eat that? No, thanks. Okay. You never hurt. There it is, a little wormage. All right, now we're gonna skin it and then play the rest of our fish, but you only have to see this one. And then we're gonna meet you back at the house. Just like that. Nice flaying right next to the water here too, just get to throw it in. And I get to rinse off my meat in salt water. And this is clean Bahamas water, so you love that cut the pin bones out, and then I cut the rest of the rib cage out right there. And that's my beautiful Nassau grouper filet. 
and we're gonna oh he's got another worm on this side we're gonna cut that out and then make these into grouper sandwiches we'll see you back at the house real quick while i'm playing this grouper i just want to say a huge shout out to stormy and her entire family for having me here in baker's bay a beautiful beautiful place in the bahamas can't say thank you enough to her whole family if you're watching that's why i'm gonna cook some lunch for you guys um mr krasinski sorry you couldn't get on the dive with us guess we're just gonna have to do it again but look at this place it's unreal Unreal. Just do a little 360 view here, Stormy. Unreal. These nice golf carts. Just get to whip around on the golf cart. <laughs> get to go in the dinghy, shoot nice fish right in front of our house. You know us. That's all I had to say. All right, we are back in Stormy's kitchen here, actually. Miss PK's kitchen. I don't think she wants to be on the camera, but we are going to make grouper sliders. So all we have here is, is hot dog buns. We just cut them in half. Just like that. And we're just gonna make little bite pieces and we're gonna go hand them out to people that are working hard and want a bite to eat. And we're not gonna need all the fish. We just need a little bit. So I'm just gonna cook it into portions like that. That's perfect for a slider. I'm just taking the clay, cutting the little portions I got. And surprisingly, which I've never seen before. I have, but not as much. I don't know why, but recently a lot of these Nassau grouper have had worms in them. And they're not poisonous and all. You can actually eat the worms raw. I've seen Victor do it. I, I'm not doing that, no thanks. Stormy said she wanted to, but I wouldn't let her. So, hi right, Stormy. No words from behind the camera? <laughs> Nothing? She's a little shy. Look, this one's got another one. I thought I cut them all out. PK, you wanna see a worm? No, thank you. Okay. Rather not see worms than food I'm gonna eat. I take them out. They're super, super harmless too. A little bit of blackened seasoning and a little bit of Old Bay, and we're going simple. We're gonna open Old Bay. I'm gonna open Old Bay in this joint. <laughs> Stormy's like this. She just like that. She just like that. Like that. Okay. Sprinkle. A little bit of Old Bay on there. One side of Old Bay, one side of Black and Seasoning. What do you think of that, Stormy? Once again, no words from the lady behind the camera. I don't know what's going on back there. She's a little shy. So am I, I'm kind of afraid of the camera. I don't like to be in front of it. <laughs> you know I'm kidding. And PK is baking me a cake because it's my birthday. So, thanks PK. Welcome. It's not my birthday. Okay, we gotta heat up this avocado oil. I forgot about that. Just, we're just doing a little, let you my We're just doing a little bit here. One shot of vodka. That was funny. You're funny. Okay, now on this side, the other side of the fish. What are you looking at? The other side of the fish I'm gonna do. PK, you can fix it if something. Johnson's black magic. Just for. Bless <coughs> you. Thank you. Just for the black, I'm blackening just one side. <coughs> Thank you. Blackening just one side of it, and then the other side, I'm just gonna cook regular. <coughs> Why are you doing it different? Why? Yeah. What do you mean different? Because you only need to blacken one side, you know? The other side, I'll just cook, or cook on low heat. Let's see. And I'm gonna go the blackened side down first. Yummy. What? It smells so good. See how it's cooking? I'm just showing you too. Doesn't again. But see how I have it on a higher heat right now, and it's already cooking up through that side. 
you get it crunchy on that side, then I'm gonna flip it over and then go low on the heat and just like finish cooking it through, you know? Yeah. We're flipping the fish here. And while we're doing that, look at the beautiful view we have behind us. You guys know how much I hate the water, so I'm not a fan of it here, actually. Kidding. Kidding. All right, so Stormy toasted these buns. Got out to Stormy for doing that. Okay, we're gonna whip it up here in the kitchen. Just a little bit. Come on. There we go. A little bit of tartar sauce. And these are just bite-sized pieces, so, I mean, look how good that is. Look how nice that fish pie is. Kidding me? Show me. Okay. A little bit of fish. A little bit of arugula. Piece of tomato on there. Um, you want a pickle? Anyone? No? Mm. No? Sure. Maybe a pickle on the side. What about that? How about that? Come on. You can't beat fresh grouper like that. Stormy? She doesn't like a lot of stuff on hers, but we'll see how it tastes. Yummy? So good. Mm -hmm. You know us, you know how we do. I'm gonna flip this joint. Are you? Peek game, I'll make you one. Oh my god, that was so good. We just ate a quick lunch. It was super, super good. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're not already subscribed to the channel, make sure you go down below and hit subscribe. Also, drop a like on this video if you enjoyed it. Did you like lunch? So good. Everybody liked lunch, and it was sliders was super easy and just a quick bite to eat. So, until next time, moving weights out. No.